Dope Podcast, man. The dopest podcast cooking. You know you sit with Jay King, Insane, Joe Bob from the Mob. And we got Diesel. That's right. This from Latin. Mom, this right. Latin Hayward, man. Calico Entertainment. Right. What's good with you, my I'm glad boy? glad you said that. I keep getting mixed up. <laughs> same old shit, different toilet, man. Oh, yeah. Man. Same yeah. stripper shirt. So, yeah. man, <laughs> first off, like man, the other one. how long you been in the game? Shit, Calico Entertainment, we started like 99, 2000. Nice. Okay. We came out with, uh, we were used to be the group uh, Neighborhood Family, Calico Entertainment Neighborhood Family. It consisted of me, King Tiger, Sea Monster, and uh, Frank Nitty. Wow. Okay. You guys are all from the Bay? We all from South Hayward, DEM. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. For yeah. sure. And what was your first project? It was Neighborhood Family, Ghetto Confessions, the album. Damn. Produced by, it was mainly produced by DJ TC out of the city. Okay, cool. Oh. Yeah, so I've seen you guys from back in the day, right? When we were doing our Thiz Latin thing and uh, Thiz Latin came up, man, you guys were, were pretty deep and you guys put out a lot of projects. Yeah. Can you tell me about some of the projects you put out through Thiz Latin and, and how did that whole Thiz Latin thing come about? That whole Thiz Latin thing came about, well, really, Goto's, we hooked up. It was like, there was a lot of funk. I wanted to, bring the homies together and, and and between the north side and the south side of Hayward. Because when I went to prison, I met a lot of homies that was from the north. And there was a lot of bloodshed back then. Wow. But really, I wanted to stop that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Because I met some good people from that side of town that I never thought I would. You know what I mean? Right. And, and then, you know, our brotherhood was just real, real, real good there. So, well, Goto's, he was looking for somebody to come from Hayward. Nice. And I ain't gonna lie, there was some, can we cuss on here? Yeah. There was some bitch-ass motherfucker trying to claim Hayward on that shit. Right. So I got at Goto's, and, and I was like, hey, look, I'm trying to bring my city together right now. Because I had went to prison. You know, all of us went to prison. That we, you know what I'm saying? I'll, t- I'll go back to that later, though. But like, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> so I'm like, I'm trying to bring my city together and stop the red on red. Right. Yeah. Cause you know, it was, a lot of it was bullshit, bro. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? And I did, I was able to do that. Right. So Talk through the music that. actually too. And if you look up, you see the, the, there's a video called the stat. And that was the first thing ever I did with Goto's. Okay. You know what I mean? Goto's is like, Hey, I'll pay for the video. Nice. You know what I mean? And um, I was like, all right. And then he, I, I don't really, I don't think that people even thought that we was going to do that. Right. Like, my, like my whole neighborhood family. So basically we got with Ill Will, which I went to prison with. We were on the bus together, Quentin. Damn. You know what I mean? Like looking at each other like, how are we going to act? It's both our first time in San Quentin. So me and Ill Will, what do you mean? We from Hayward. That's right, homie. Bing, we, we rock it. Right. It went, went that way, I went that way. You know what I mean? It will, you know what I'm saying? He caught more time. You know what I mean? I went that way. But basically, we became real tight, me and it will. You know what I'm saying? And I met a lot of homies from that side that were just real tight. You yeah. know what I mean? And I was trying to stop the, the bullshit in the city. Really. Yeah, right. You know what I mean? And so you think the the by you forming this Latin, it it, it was uh, one of the reasons why Hayward came together? It gave it an outlet to kind of go Yeah, together. actually, it wasn't just me that, that started it. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I just kept going with it. You know what I mean? The ones who started was me, Ill Will, Little Speedy Lokes, Speedy Lokes' the son right. from the Ramos. You know what I'm saying? Calico Timo. You know what I mean? Because we were the ones out. You know what I mean? Uh, okay. wow. You know what I mean? So we started... The this line Hayward, but then people started, you know, they had their own things to do. They couldn't really, you know, music. You got to keep going, right? You got to be consistent on everything you do. If you're doing shows, you got to do shows. You know what I mean? <coughs> if you're doing everything, like he's doing comedy, yeah, he got to push the comedy. That's his art. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Podcast is y'all art. Y'all gonna push this. I've right? been hearing that same thing from very reputable people I love very much all my life. And I'm like, why do they keep fucking with me like that? Because I don't be consistent. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be you know consistent, bro. I be telling them the same thing. Uh, oh. uh, what they say, they said, uh, 
uh, procrastination is the assassination of motivation. Yeah. Right. And if and Real if talk. and if your motivation is gone, then your discipline has to kick in to keep shit going. Aka. Right. And I got true. shit I'm doing this for too. It ain't. It, yeah. And besides that, the music, it's my passion, bro. Yeah. Mm. Right. I don't make a million dollars off this shit, bro. I'm gonna keep it one thousand. You know what I mean? I. But, hey, I love doing music, bro. Right. Yeah. You know, it's in my, it's in me. It's yeah. the best high I could ever get. Right. You know it's I mean? a way to tell your story too, right? Like, uh, you know, shit that goes on without having to crash out in real life. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's a way to release that, that, right. that aggression. Um, so uh, when you say there's a passion, it's in me. So like, have you been in a booth, dropped a good 16 and have that adrenaline flow happen to you? <laughs> you have? I, as, hey, I have. As high ever, yeah, I, yeah, right. And you're like. If really? you know a hunter is like a fisherman, they'll get it right when they get into something. You dope, can like, feel that too. Like you can feel that. I know it's crazy. I do. Yeah. Damn, you I just can, shake how you just I can feel good up. vibes when I walk in the room. Like yeah. when I walked in this room, yeah. I felt nothing but good vibes. Yes, sir. Yeah. Through music and through yeah. what we you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I feel nothing but good vibes. I could get into a room and I could feel nothing but bad yeah. vibes. Yeah, you blessed your sermon. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The like, chance for that to poker, you can get your ass in a hand. I done, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. I was like, well, he laughing now. He finally got a hand. Watch this shit. Yeah. <laughs> Real shit. Well, so tell us about the, oh, like your projects with this. Like, I know you've done, you you have several artists. You've done a lot of compilations. You work with some big people. I mean, just right here, Mac Dre, uh, yeah. RBL. Uh, and I fucked with Mac Dre when he was alive, too. Like, I really fucked. And the reason, let me tell you about Mac Dre. The reason why he even fucked with me is because I was a homie. He, w- I, I don't even think he would fuck with the other side. Uh, Keep it real. When when he fucked with me, he's like, oh, you're a homie? Right. He straight up said it. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah, I'm going to fuck with you. And I hooked up with him through TC. You know what I mean? Right. It, it was just, it was, and then after that, he had called me to his studio, Soundway Studio. He used to be in West Oakland. Hey, come fuck with me. But then I went to prison. Right. We were all on that. That's when them that fake ass gang enhancement. You know what I'm saying? Throw a case on you for nothing as right. bullshit shit was right. going on there right. at first. You know what I mean? So, with that shit. so that's what I was going through. Yeah, they were getting away with a lot of bullshit. You yeah, know what I mean? I know when uh Mac, I knew Mac Dre when he was alive, right? I, I did uh Straight Lace magazine. We interviewed him. We you, you like we were around him at shows and parties, and uh he always showed love to the homies, right? And one thing, uh when when this they had signed Double Shot, who were some undercovers, right? Yeah. And uh I told this story before on here, you know what I mean? I think uh, I've seen that too. Yeah, yeah, where you know they they went out to Stockton and we were like, nah can't have that right uh and and one of one of my main reasons was i knew mac dre wouldn't you know what i mean he wasn't with that you know what i mean and like i'm not gonna speak for him you know what i mean but everything that i've seen everything when i was around like he had love for the homies you know what i mean yeah really the whole thiz family got love for the homies oh yeah definitely. you know miami all them they got love for the homies yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. And yeah. and that's Shout why out Miami that, too, man. that's why they, they, they you know that that double shot never dropped you know what I mean yeah. because you know they 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 had love you know what I mean and Good uh, job. yeah yeah <laughs> that's Good job yeah, yeah. That so sports yeah sports yeah so all right you get one too you know, I, get, I got five this week I'll get two all later yeah. but no, it's but, good but but that's that you know uh, going back to your history I mean you've dealt with a lot of people I mean even right here Spice One Spice One like, he's see, from Hayward yeah Spice One yeah. I grew up with Hayward he's Spice, Hayward. Uh, he's Spice from the West Side from the South Side but we always got along yeah, yeah. you know what I mean. He's he's real. He's a real one. I was a fan when he came out. Yeah, me too. Because you know it was awesome. <laughs> he killing a hundred motherfuckers in his song. I'm like, damn. But <laughs> if he's really gnarly and you hear somebody finally be gnarly on the track, you're like, oh, he'd really oh, be man. on the block too, though. So, so you know what I mean? I, I enjoy this shit. We'd be out there on the dice like game, the West Side, and South Side. Yeah. What was that song he did? Now everybody's talking about gin and juice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, that 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 yeah, was wow. yeah, one eight seven proof. Give yeah, that. one eight seven proof. When I heard that, <laughs> it was and the way that was broken down and the way he told the story. Yeah, yeah. That that's that's some. Real like yeah. next level stuff. And, and and most rappers, in my opinion, man, they, there's a step above being a rapper. You be MC. Right. That's when you take music a little different like that. Now you become the thing you talking about, or the metaphors are deeper or thicker. You know what I'm saying? Or, Me, I look at it like 
me, I'm not a metaphor rapper. I'm a game spitter. I just spit the game that I know. I'm dead. Day. I, I couldn't like day. how some people get their raps written. Yeah. I don't even know how people could even say another man's rap. Right. <laughs> you know what I mean? I yeah, don't. I, do. <laughs> I couldn't. I couldn't get a rap and rap something else that somebody else yeah. wrote. Yeah. Right. I couldn't do it. Yeah. Well, you know because I mean? we grew up like that, right? Like if you wasn't you wasn't real, uh, real really rapping if you were rapping someone else's shit. Right. They got to come from within you. Well, I mean, the California curse in hip hop has been a little different. It's curse for some. You can't punch in. You got to mean it. You got to be like for real. Ben, live what you saying. One take, Jake. You know yeah. what I'm saying? There was some jacked up shit. The shows you used to have man. to come and fucking perform before you even did a show That's to see real. if you could even be on the show. And I'm talking right. about 90% of us. Now people just pay their little money and they're garbage and you got 50 people rapping on the show that's Good garbage. Good engineer, good producer. Oh, yeah. Got you, you sounding you know I mean? gold. Yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely. So. Well, I got the good... I really thought... I ain't a super rapper. I'm a game spirit, but... But, like, with... Like, this land opened up a lot more doors for us because, like, sure. my group, my whole clique... C. Massa got 69 with L. Frank Nitty got 15 with L. I had got five. And my my brother, King Tiger OG, he, he got some music out right now, too. And he's coming soon. Hard, too. Nice. You know what I mean? He just did 14 in the feds. Okay. So, like, we were all gone. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So when I was in prison, I'm, like, thinking, hey, how can I help my little youngsters out there? Not be in the position that I'm in. Yeah, not not all the way out. Right. Like right now, I'll go to the hood. And, hey, if y'all doing music, come on, I got you. I'm paying for everything. Mm. And I don't got money like that, believe it. Don't think I got money. None of that. I don't got no money like that. Want to push the sacrifice. But I, yeah, and, and you know what I mean? Real talk. And I'm going to help the little homies yeah. and try to show them. Because that's something I didn't have. That's, that's big. Like I'm taking them to sign up for college for music. Yeah, I actually did too. For me, my son, my son got all his master's degrees from that shit. Damn, engineering. Now we're on that lawyer side. He's doing Sick. the entertainment lawyer shit. That's what's up. Calico yeah. Beats. Check his beats out. Calico Beats, man. All right. You know what I mean? Yeah. We're gonna have to get some of them beats from you. Oh man, I got <laughs> some beats for you. Oh man, that's we, what's up. Yeah. So, uh, how many albums you have under Thiz Latin? Okay. Uh, Thiz Latin Hayward. Yeah. Cause I own this land, Hayward. I pay my taxes every year for that. There you go. Okay, that's your. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, but it is Calico Entertainment. But under this Latin Hayward, under that label, there's 180 songs on Disney. Wow. Shit. So, you ever see a check on that shit? I see a check, but not really. See, I'm just learning all the. I didn't know about that the part. four ways to get paid. Yeah. yeah. The publishing. Well, I didn't know. But well, now I know. Yeah. Y'all don't go try to publish my shit because I already did it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the thing, too. Like, that's, that's what I would say. You know, I'm a little younger. You know what I mean? So I'm 31. But I remember, like, when I was coming up, while well, my older folks, they didn't really have the game to, to do the stuff like, the, you know, their taxes and, yeah. and, and how to write shit off and, and how to do a business account, LLCs, umbrella, none of that they stuff. They never man. taught us that in school. They uh, taught us how to pay taxes for that uh, other man. Yeah. Hey, that's, you know what? That's you know what I mean? That's thing we need to probably do on this, yeah. this program, actually, is some of us kind of know. Right. And some people were very close to us still trying to find out. Yeah. Right. You know what I mean? Well, I yeah, mean, we'll get to that. How to get your shit legit for sure. And for that's, sure. you know, we that's, charge her for that episode. I'm playing. Yeah, <laughs> but that's but that's the good thing that's though. Serious you know episode. Know I mean? Like people ain't people are like you. Know I mean, the homie ain't charging that to get that game no, out when he's yeah, learning yeah, it. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I mean, that's cool, man. I, you feel me? That's dope that yeah. you can help these kids out and shit okay. like that. Because I wish, because it's like this, bro. You can either give them a gun and some dope, or you can give them some game to get in the lane. You know what I mean? If I feel like if you already been running around, you you, you verified in my hood or something like that, then I'm gonna give you the good shit. Yeah, especially like. Some of these youngsters got a hustle to them, bro. Yeah. So why not show them a good hustle? Right. Nobody showed me that well, shit. Yeah, right. A couple of us older heads only got option number one. Yeah. You know Think about it. We would have had a music <laughs> school back then. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. We'd yeah. be way further than we were right. than we are now. Definitely. Right. I'd start rapping. In the public center like them. <laughs> <laughs> so, <clears throat> so you were locked up before this Latin Hayward started. Yeah. Okay. yeah. So, I did five hours in San Quentin, high desert. But I ain't been to jail in hell long either. Congratulations. Really, I think this music is kind of helping me out on that. Mm -hmm. All right. For a minute there, I was going to jail all the time. Like, yeah. You know what I mean? Right. I was and, a horrible criminal. 
Yeah. I was a horrible criminal. <laughs> this motherfucker. I was a good one. Cause I, I got caught. I got away with more shit than I got caught yeah. for. Yeah. 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 Hey, but, but that was back then, though. You yeah. ain't getting away with shit now. All these fucking great. cameras and snitches. Fuck it. Right. You can't do that. <laughs> Everybody want to pull out their phone. Look what's going on. So what do you think your biggest project is from uh, out of all the projects you've done so far? I, right now? Because um, I'm working on a blues album right now. Yeah, so, <laughs> like, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah, He's all G, Mike Spider-Man Robinson, the best keyboardist there is. Really? He's like seven years old. He, he didn't, you know, the feeling this way old school. He was the original one that did that. He's my business partner in my studio. Bingo. Okay. You know what I mean? Um, so right now I'm working on some different kind of music. I did some rock and roll. I'm working. I put out a lot of R&B, uh, Rico and Rava out of uh, out of Hunters Point. Nice. Um, I put their, they sing. They don't that's rap. It. You know yeah, what I mean? That's it. And I put out my nephew. My, I. But like as big as numbers, I don't got numbers like that. Like, gotcha. but I got a bunch of shit that gotten. I might, I might not have that much number, but I got 180 songs that got. Shit's under cooking. A little bit, it's yeah, cooking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, so all that stuff equals one big check. It's like right. I planted all the fucking seeds, mm-hmm. right? And I just need you that circle one. Circle back around the water. So I got Rave and Rico one time R and B. I got Ruffy Gotti. He does everything. He plays acoustic, he plays electric, That's he dope. sings, he even does country. That's you know what dope. I mean? So I, I, I'm, we're actually working on this album called Street Grease. And it's going to ha- have seven genres in it. That's so it's going to have bro. reggae, rock That's and roll, sick, heavy metal. I'm with that. You know what I'm saying? All on one yeah. album, yeah. one cover. And Spider-Man got the hook up. We, we're going to get it on every radio station and every... On every that's, genre. That's, 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 that's pretty so, daring this okay. shit. You know what I mean? I, I would tell you to put blues on hip hop and it was dope. And my daddy playing. I call it blues mob. Blues mob, okay. There you yeah. go. You know what I'm saying? Blues, blues mob. You know what I mean? I want to do different things, bro. Sure. Like So that's all coming out on Thiz Latin? Huh? Hey, yeah. No. No. Calico Entertainment. Calico. Yeah. You Calico. still have a relationship with Thiz? Yeah. Well, yeah. I'm Thiz Latin Hayward. I own it. So oh, my bad. How could I not have a relationship? I just with assumed any of this Latin shit was was toes, but I'm I'm not I'm not extremely educated. I'm this Latin Hayward chapter. Gotcha. Toes helped start all that. Yeah, for sure. You know what I mean? Right. But it's your own separate company. Yes. Gotcha. Yeah. Nobody helps me with my taxes on the end of the year. Yeah. Right. <laughs> but he did. People right. looked out. He Gold Toes looked out for me like a motherfucker too. Yeah. Right. And I can't deny that. I yeah. can never do that. Right. Yeah. I don't think anybody can who's yeah, part and, of it. And, you know. And, I mean? and if you listen to the old neighborhood family album, there's a song called Nike's is Evidence. When Gold Toes is banging one foe on there. Yeah. You know what I mean? I actually went to Gold Toes because it was the homies. Right. And that was the home team. Right. Yeah. Right? Yeah. yeah. Ain't and no so, denying what that man done for business. Yeah. So, and uh, and when we went to Texas, man, he showed us so much love out there. Right. Mansion party, all the shit. You know what I mean? Right. There's no doubt what Toast has done for the culture, right? Yeah. Especially up here in Northern California, like there's yeah. no denying that. Yeah. So what is what is your view on what Toast is doing now? Right now, I can't condone to anything that's going on the streets right now. That's not your flavor. Is 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 not me. It's Where common. I live, it's it's, it's not like that. Right. right now, and actually, I think you're okay. You're trying to stop lights. That's that's wonderful. Trying to save somebody's life, right? Right. But where I'm from, is kind of like creating more hostility. Right. I mean, oh no shit. Yeah. Do more harm than good and shit. Like now, all of a sudden, we got that writing all over down the street. Oh, gotcha. In blue color. From the other side. From now people color. are poking the bear and shit. Yeah, like, yeah. like on Tennyson Road, bro. Right. You know what I mean? I'm from Tennyson Road. You know what I mean? Like, as little Joe 211 when he come up in here, bro. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. He going to tell you how Tennyson Road is, bro. Right. Huh. And I ain't disrespecting nobody because I just, I'm a true believer in people should stay in their own lanes, bro. Right. L.A. should stay in L.A. lane. Definitely. If you're La Raza or whatever. I mean... Northern California should stay in Northern California. Right. 
You know what I mean? For for all purposes of ten, I agree. But like in business, that's where people venture out, try new shit. You know what I mean? Why not venture, venture no, out? Hold on, just just I'm, I, I, I'm about to say how wild <laughs> business, business goes wild. It's like all of a sudden you start promoting. It's cool to be like girl dressing and dudes doing this some shit like just wild. You know oh, what I'm man. saying? And none of us at this table now is in agreement with all the wild shit out there they doing in the business. Yeah, I but, can't right. condone that, and I can't condone with skinny jeans. Yes. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. We just hold your fist on the outside with those. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. So, yeah, so... so or, 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 or wear a purse. Yeah, yeah, the man purses. I'm not digging the man purses. Yeah. Yeah. Like they, ain't do, they ain't doing the, the, the pouch no more with a dough or something in it. I they rock. I full blown handles, arm strap, purse. I mean, when I was a kid, you used to get beat up for that shit. I pull up. I pull up with a fanny pack right. around, my, <laughs> around my chest and shit. Uh, uh, fanny uh, pack, man. No, I don't know about a fanny pack. Oh, uh, well, that's yeah. gangster. That's yeah. gangster. Yeah. 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 Fanny pack in the front. Yeah. <laughs> Unless you got your thing up in there. Oh yeah. You know I mean, uh, what? that's you working in sports coach. You So so yeah. So uh, about these projects and that you got coming out and everything, right? So how do you? How's your formula for putting projects out? Like what do? You, what's your go-to like standard like? My formula is DJTC out of San Francisco, Hunters Point, California. Yeah. And hey, y'all don't try to take my recipe either, though, man. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> My son, Calico Beats, them are the only people I'll buy beats from. Really? So you buy it from your own Keep son? Keep it in-house. No, I don't, I don't buy it from him, but I give him money. Oh, yeah, 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 I feel you. We're, we're, we're a team. Yeah. You know what I mean? He's a team. Me, Calico, Timo's a team. We are all a team. Z-Money, 343, it, it, like, all, everybody that we rock with, we're, we, we, we move as one. He's seen us at the shows, bro. Like, right. We we're we're family. We're all related down there too. Yeah. We're all related. Little King Monty's my nephew. Tiger's my brother. You know what I mean? Like we are all like related somehow, some way, and we're from the same hood. Right. And you were saying King Tiger Tiger just came home, right? He just got home, man. You know what I mean? And, you know, he he's running through the ringer with the system right now because you know. Thank you. But he's home and his album is coming soon and he's doing good. He got a job. And he's doing real good, and they can't stand it. Right. You know. Well, when when people come out of the system and and end up beating the system, yeah, they don't like that. You know what I mean? They 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 they, they it's built like a pipeline to you know constantly go back, right? He's you already been up. violated three times for something he didn't even do. Man, right. Right. well, there yeah. it is. They're trying to put him back just, in the pipeline. Yeah, they were yeah. like just proving him wrong. And he's doing real good. He got a job. Yeah, there's a lot of good artists and a lot of good people right now. Came work. out of here with All he like does that. is right now work, goes fishing, and does music. All right. So and he can't even really dropping? do the music because he can't even leave his backyard. You know what yeah. I'm saying? When's yeah. his album? He's dropping? got the Irish Rolex. He got stuff out right now. King Tiger OG, keep it real. This is before the last violation. He, he keep it real. If you look it up, King Tiger OG, keep it real. You know I mean that's his video. But King Tiger OG, and he got all his neighborhood family. Every song before we all went to prison, it was neighborhood family. Okay. And we're working with his son, little King Monty. Son's dope. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So how many artists you have now, right now, signed that you're ready to put out? Eight. Wow. What are the, who's all of them? I saw yeah, we, know, we got King Tiger. We got King Tiger OG, Little King Monty, Rava. A one time Rico, a one time. Oh, Raver's the one that's saying, I got bitches Sick, to yeah. buy me clothes on 11.5. Right. That's Raver. Okay. That's Rico's that's with him. That, you know what I mean? Um, I got Sea Monster. I got Little Drowsy just came home too. Little Drowsy? Yeah, Little Drowsy. I was in bar with that fool. Yeah, you were? Yeah. Yeah. He just got home too. You that's know what I mean? Up. Welcome home, brody. Yeah, he's doing good too. He got a job. He's staying away. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. We're going to get him off his parole. That's yeah, what, yeah. That's my mission. Real talk, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Is go to work and get all that parole, man. You know what I mean? Oh, and I got little King Money. Did I say that? Yeah. Um, Z Money three four three, Roost three four three. He's my Polynesian homie. He's a homie, but he's Polynesian. Okay, you dude. know what I mean? Yeah, and I had more, but you know how that is. So, and and, and I agree with people because I don't know everybody. Is that that's more than just like and homies? Calico Beats is he's making. Music too. He got stuff. You look at all up on Instagram. All them artists, man. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Is, is, is that different races of folk? That ain't just like a homie. That's a, oh man, my my neighborhood is Mob University. Yeah. yeah. 
Mexican yeah. others and brothers. Got yeah. you. Yeah. My neighborhood is just like it. Half blood, half half homie. Like you that. know what I mean? Like real talk, we got Guamanian. Yeah. My my a lot of my OGs are Guamanian blood too. Wow. I'm gonna keep it real. Yeah. This is how we grow up in South Hayward. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And um, but you know, you know what it is. <laughs> right. No, and a lot of people like they a lot of people who aren't from the Bay don't understand how the Bay rolls. Right, even in the valley, it's different from the bay, right? Yeah. We fuck with the bay all day, but the stock the way, is like us too. Yeah. yeah. You guys are like drink like us. <laughs> <laughs> but from like the, from like there's a difference in how the bay gets down, right? A lot of people who are outside of even Northern California don't understand like it's a melting pot. And when yeah. you say it's a melting pot, like people always say, like, man, why you talk like that or whatever? If they're not from over here, they don't get our get down. Right. Can you explain a little bit of how the get down is over in Hayward? The get down is in Hayward is this. You got a box of baby pit bulls. You got a brown one. You got a white one. You got a black one. You got one. But they all vicious. <laughs> yeah. Like you know what I mean? Stuff, I like that. They find a way to eat together, right. live together. They live together and tear your ass up together. Right. <laughs> Straight up. That's their box. And it, remember, we're, we're a little city. Yeah. So and we're like two, we're four exits away from Oakland, from East Oakland. Yeah. So back in the days, we had to go through a lot of shit and held it down. You know what I mean? Like, like my neighborhood is like South Hayward. We got the mural. We're the only ones left with the. The last Latino mural in Hayward. Really? Okay. They painted over A Street one. They're, they're putting little stuff and all that. So I'm right now, I'm trying to work and get this. We're going to do a fundraiser and get, we're, I'm trying to get the mural painted. That's what I'm nice. on right now. Like that's shit awesome. like that. You know what I mean? That's Let dope. me know how we can donate to that. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Because sure. uh, that, 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 that mural yeah. was in 79 painted by a lot of homies. Well, There's a lot of history. That's why they ain't painted over it. It's so faded. It looks fucked up right now. But there's a lot of... they try, When they try to come paint, it was like, nah, you ain't paint over this. Like, you know what I mean? So what's the fundraiser? How how would people get a hold of you to, to, to like, donate? Right now? Right now, I got somebody trying to get at the city council, really, and help us out. Nice. But if they I'll don't... Let, if they Dan don't, because I've been trying to do that for four years, bro. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. If they don't, we're going to throw a car wash... Right there in the hood, across the street from the, the mural, with the homie, like how we do the fundraiser when when a little nigga dies, you know, like recipes of little OJ. We 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 gathered up like twelve bands doing a car wash right there. For, nice for his family. We could probably so, bring some models to help do it too. Yeah, wash yeah. the cars. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about that oh, stuff. Yeah. Yeah. My car's dirty. Yeah, <laughs> God bless the game. Uh, yeah, man. Fact, hold on. Here's my donation. Right yeah. now. Got a whole there, note. Uh, start. Yeah. there we go. Just to start. That's my donation to yeah. Porter Mural. Cash app. Right there. Zell, you know yeah. what I mean? Oh, and, yeah, uh, I don't like being sure. You know what I mean? Because <laughs> any, any anything, anything like like for a cause like that, I'm down for it, man. And, yeah. and you guys are trying to raise money to get to get the mural up. That's part of history. It's part of Hayward history. I'm not from Hayward. Hey, y'all see that? It. Y'all see yeah. that? That that's Northern California love right there, yeah, man. And, and that, we'll that's show the after exactly I send it, it later. It's, it's, <laughs> it's, it's, it's Northern California love. Like I said, man, I support anything that 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 have, that's positive. You know what I mean? That that and that's gonna further people. And that's part of history right there. Right. Yeah. I love seeing that shit. And so, you know, on hip hop, that's yeah. culture. Like right. Like said, yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. But deserve whatever whatever you can anytime you can. Yeah. Obviously. I'll, you know, so um, yeah, you know, I know, I mean, I'll die for that mural. There you go. Right. Straight up, right there. And, and, and I know that's, well, something, that's one, important. There's $100 yeah. hours less to not do that shit now. Yeah. Yeah. Right. There you go. Well, and, and, man, thank you very much. No, I, I appreciate hey, I appreciate you guys for keeping it lit. Thanks, up. Oh, yeah. yeah. And just looking out. You guys are looking out. Yeah, well, we, you know, we're trying, we trying to do our best, you know what I mean, with what, you know, what we got, you know what I mean? Our platform is not the biggest, you know what I mean? But we are growing, you know, We're every day. Relevant lane. And, uh, you know, we we try to push, like, solid individuals like yourself. You know what I mean? We try to push people, uh, a lot of people who don't get the shine because of whatever reason, you know what I mean? We're trying to bring it up, and we're trying to come up together, you know what I mean? Because right. that's it's what the, it's all it's about. It's the whole circumference of the history of it all. Right, yeah. You know I mean, you're getting every issue of the 
And, right. and and it's not just homies, right? We're yeah. trying to push anybody who, who who's doing something positive in Northern California. Right. You right. know what I mean? And we Bay keep, area. you know what I mean? Yeah. Bay Northern area. California. That, you ain't even that's gotta, the thing. That's the thing. You ain't too. even got to be in Northern California. You could be in Oregon, Washington, Utah, yeah. Nevada, yeah. Texas. Yeah. You yeah. know, anywhere across the state, Mexico. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But there, yeah. I mean, we'll yeah. You, I mean, FaceTime, you could even be in LA, just just not a Southerner. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, cause there's, I mean, there's a there's a lot of cool there. There's more to LA than just Southerners. That's right. right? I, I mean, there's there's taggers over there that, that, that ain't got nothing to do with it. There's skateboarders. There's there's Bloods. There's Crips. You know what I mean? So there's there's Tongans. You know what I mean? There's a there's a whole bunch of there's there's a whole different culture in LA. There's many right. cultures, I should say, in LA. That's LA is is just that's separated. But the more you hear about is the other side. That's yeah. that that's the predominant. That because they're 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 messy. You know what I mean? They they're out there. They're loud. And they just want to be like us. I mean, yeah. hey, I would too. Well, we're hey. not loud like that. We're I would too. <laughs> I would too. You know, yeah. But that's that's the thing though. That's what it takes, man. It takes like like what I be saying. Like, oh, you guys shout us. You know, we're all gonna go. If we're at a show, take a picture in front of their booth, holding their clothes. Take a picture for theirs. You guys tag each other. You, everybody's platform yeah, is building now. You know what I mean? Network, You're getting man. other people's eyes and ears on on what you have going on and what they have going on. You know what I mean? It's just public relations, marketing, and promoting, man. And you know and, I mean? and and also supporting each other, right? Because the first thing a motherfucker want to do is be like, oh, you got shirts. Oh, oh, let me get a discount. Well, I can get it at the I can get it at the T-shirt outlet for fifteen dollars. You selling it for twenty five? Exactly. Ah, bro, hey, break bread for that twenty five. But when I break bread that twenty five for you, you gonna break the bread that twenty five yeah. for me, and that's how we all gonna win. Hey, and I'll be honest, that's the that's how I see a lot of the events I go to with homies. How y'all get down? Right. And I grew up at different events. Exactly what you just said. Twenty five dollars, motherfucker. I got about ten bucks on me. Oh man, I got you, man. Right. You know, we be short changing each other. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Although I appreciate free shit all day. Yeah, I'm not. But I don't expect it. You know what I mean? I like. I love to support, especially right. the homies. I love, yeah, I love yeah. to support. Because yeah. if, it makes if me I don't feel good, yeah, if I don't go to Target and none of this shit, and then I'm not, I'm not gonna haggle with their price. But I'm gonna haggle with my folks' price. There you go. Right. Like, it's you like this, mean? bro. I can't even good. charge a homie for a suit. Let alone anything else, bro. Yeah. But I I love to support, and I love when people do support. That's you know what I'm saying? You just said that. Right. You know what I mean? Because I grew up, with, it's like this. If I need that $100 tomorrow, bad, bad, I'm going to be like, and you know me. I'm like, man, shoot me that 100 I'll give you 200 like on fucking Wednesday. And I, I hella mean it. And they know I mean it. It's like, here. Right. But I have to double up, you know what I'm saying? The, yeah. You know, that's yeah. how I came up. And y'all just yeah, like, no, I got you. No, nah, because so that's a that's pretty cool support. Yeah, no, because you know that's I mean? something that we, you know, what I mean, that's something we. You got know why all money ain't good money? You could be going other places and trying to get this money. Yeah, you only sell out your hey, I respect a hustler. Yeah, and I I don't hate on nobody. I'm not even my op. I sure. won't hate on you. Yeah. yeah, you know what I mean. Like, but all money is not good money, and I was always taught that by my OG. Right. Like, you know what I mean? Well, it's different now, right? Yeah. Because a lot of people say, oh, man, do it for the bag, right? Like, it's all about the bag. Like, like if you're not, it, it, like, like for instance, it's homies. I think they say said you the got... same thing at his house. <laughs> <laughs> but, like, as, as, as homies, yeah, you ain't lying, yeah. but as homies, right, they say, oh, don't do home music because you're keeping yourself in the box. You're denying yourself from that bag, Right. But not everything is about the bag. Like, yeah, do people want to get money? Yeah, right. But there's there is there's a deeper there's a yeah. deeper uh, uh, meaning behind it, behind it. There's there's a deeper feeling. There's that carnalismo that you Ooh. feel that's 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 deeper than money. Like mm-hmm. money can't buy carnalismo. Like I can it give can't. you I can give you a thousand dollars. Doesn't make you my homie. I can give you a million dollars. Doesn't make you you know what I mean. Doesn't mean you're gonna ride for me. I, it just means I gave you a million dollars. But the are minute, you, are you subliminally but, telling me something? Uh, no, I'm telling. I'm saying any, anybody, right? But the, you know, what I mean, the minute shit goes bad, oh, like, motherfuckers turn matter. their back on you quick. You can't buy right? loyalty, right? You can't buy it's like you could have all the commissary in the world, everybody, right? Right. But if you don't throw that spread on September 16th, it don't mean nothing. Man. That part, you know what I mean? Yeah. That part. Like, so I agree with everything you just said, right? And I and I agree in how y'all get down and, and the support and the love that y'all show, you know what I'm saying, throughout. You know what I'm saying? I am one of the ones being in the studio, harassing artists I know, get out the backyard with some of this music. You don't have to all the way game on this song. Somebody get y'all where it don't matter no more. 
No. Somebody get over that fucking step where now it don't matter. See, I'm not talking about gang banging, you know no, right? You gang, gang banging on music. That's you know what I mean. If if you do it, you do it. If you don't, you don't. But I'm not talking about that per se. I'm just talking about selling your soul, right? Selling selling out for a bag, right? Being being something you're not. Like if somebody says, "Hey, I give you I give you ten thousand dollars right now to rap with a southerner." No. You gonna take it? No. Hell no. Nah. I might but take why? the ten grand because all my what, what about the bag? Money. But what about the bag? It's all Fuck about yeah. the bag, though. What about twenty thousand? I'll get a bag somewhere else. But how? You how? I mean? How much? I might. I might walk away with that bag still, though. How much is your price? No problem, yeah, 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 that's all I'm saying. <laughs> uh, you, how, how, digital, how, how much? How much is your integrity worth? Right. Yeah. I, I couldn't yeah. really. Fifty thousand. I couldn't do it. A hundred thousand. I ain't doing it. I couldn't. I couldn't, but and that and that's and that's that's where it is. Like like I wouldn't spit in my hente's face. Yeah. Right, that part. Right. So what? I wouldn't do it. That's it. that's the thing. What's your integrity worth? Right. Yeah. That's what it all comes down to. When motherfuckers talk about, oh, it's all about the bag. Like that means you'll do anything for that money. So there's shit. There, they're like like that means you'll disrespect your family, your yeah. people. Your loved ones all because of that bag. That's, that's why, why there's that's why, why there's a lot of that's why there's a lot of broke rich people. And right. people you know doing saying? that. Hell. I'm hood rich. It's that's all that matters hell. to me. You know what I mean? My grandkids in my hood. So like other than that, like, you know what I mean? Like that that what am I like how could I even encourage some shit or condone some shit? It's not like some impossible shit to even conceive. Yeah, or fuck to that. understand. Like right. and I'm suburban a lot of rich. People you know what I'm saying? On the other side of your own block you that is willing it. to sell out whatever that was their morals. For music, for a bag, or for the next opportunity. I just had this talk with a, a very respected friend of mine who was in the music game, and he was like, "Not doing that." Well, you, know you you can look at people like Big Tone, right? For an example, he 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 gets his money That's regardless. Right. Big Tone, but, what's up, man? But big but Big Tone, I have not seen him sell his integrity for money, but he gets his money, yep. right? I make a pretty good living, right? So if motherfuckers he come at me with whatever. And I'm not going to sell my soul. I'm not going to sell my integrity because I can get it. I, I got it out the mud. I can get it. And if I lose it all, I can get it back again. Any real hustler, anybody from Northern California yeah. is a real hustler. They you know, know how, how to get, get it. it. Right. Mm -hmm. I've, I've done lost. I've done had it. I done lost it. I done had it again, lost it again. And now I'm up again. So uh -huh. because of that, I know I don't need to sell my soul. I don't need the bag. Some people, though, they get blinded by the cash, man. They get blinded by them Benjamins, and they're like, oh, shit, like, uh, well, fuck, for, for 20000 yeah, I guess I can do this. Nah. I guess I can sell out my home. I guess I can disrespect everybody that died for the cause. The studio with them. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Being, yeah. Being, yeah. We ain't got to be in the studio yeah. with these guys. And I never even got it out the mud. I got it out like yeah. the puddle, maybe like a dirty <laughs> puddle or something, you know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah. But, shit, I ain't doing right. none of that. I mean, little, that, that tea party, I don't want to be part of that. No. Nah. Yeah, right. There's a tea party going on. And real talk, in my opinion, you know what I mean? I... I wasn't invited, and I'm glad I wasn't. And if I, I wouldn't be there because that cup of tea is poison, right? Right. right. And right. and, and, and you, if motherfuckers want to poison themselves, go ahead. Right. You want right. to make the bed, you lay. Well, you're, you're, you're not in you're peace saying? without it right now. That's why you would consider it like, or sell out. To really, get it. like in my music, it. you got to be peace with it. And my without. music, I don't. I wasn't really super gang banging on the stack, yeah maybe, but I don't really super gang bang. But now it's like to the point where I'm feel like I'm being disrespected. Isn't that weird? You know what I mean? I feel like I'm being disrespected. Right. You get what I'm saying? So now it's like, okay, this fool just said them wrong words, the weird ass words that he be saying all the time. Like, you know what I mean? Right. And I don't want to say dude's name because he don't even don't deserve it. You know right. <laughs> say cockroach. Right. Yeah, one of the cockroaches. cockroaches. They they keep disrespecting. You know what I mean? Right. And and that's that because you didn't say his name. I don't mean to cut you off, but yeah. we just had tracks on here earlier, right? Um, and we we just dropped a video with tracks, and he he made a song, right? Because his name got mentioned, and the whole episode we didn't say the person's name. People know who it is. You could read between the lines, but we didn't say the person's name, right? Because their whole thing is, oh, you gotta you gotta you gotta keep the our side in the mouth in your mouth to, to to get somewhere but that's not true we don't give a shit about that because one we didn't start talking about y'all till you started talking about us and two we don't give a shit it's not that important we're gonna do what we do regardless 
Like I said, correct like, me if I'm wrong. I'd rather do music than than play with it. Play with them cockroaches. Right. Real talk. No, I feel you, man. Huh. And uh, that that tea party line. That's that that's a good one, man. I don't have to use that as a tea party. I wasn't invited to. You know what I mean? And uh, yeah. But I'm glad I wasn't. Maybe there's a reason why I wasn't. Yeah. Hey, Maybe, you hey. Know, I, I be really there like sometimes. Huh? So if I also get mad about some shit. I'm like, well, shit. Maybe, maybe I am just living God's plan. I wasn't supposed to be over there. Maybe it was going funky or something. <laughs> right. Cool with it. So now, it's, you know, it's Calico Entertainment, right? Getting back Calico. to the Calico. Hey, what a I say, I say Calico. Hey, why, you know why? why? Because Calico Vision back in the day, remember those? Yeah. 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 So Calico. No, Calico. No. K a l i c o with a K. Calico. Yeah. Right. What's Calico? Yeah. Shut up, you young motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey, RP's calling. He's all right. <laughs> Fuck, Damn near shit. I think I got my card in my wallet. <laughs> oh, I love you guys, man. It's good. Oh, yeah. Shut up. <laughs> no, but yeah, so uh, that's what's coming up, right? That's what you're pushing now. And uh, well, I've been pushing it. It's been Calico this whole time yeah. since we first started with Neighborhood Family. We transferred to Disneyland Hayward. But, you know, everybody from with us is not all Latin either. Okay. Yeah. You know what I mean? Right. I'm only a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So, like like I said, we're Haystackians. You know what I'm saying? We all sell up with the Northern Hispanic. You know what I'm saying? Right. But Calico is, that's what we pushing. Right. Calico ENT and still Disneyland Hayward. Yeah. You know what I mean? But it's Calico E&T. You right. know what I mean? Right. And so you said that, uh, I, I don't know if you want to talk about this or not, but you said you um, got out the hospital. You know what I mean? Uh, you know what I mean? So how did that affect your music? Um, if, it, it, affect, if it didn't affect my writing it, or nothing like that because I didn't catch, I call it a stroke. Um, you know what I mean? Just not living right. You know what I mean? Yeah, when I got home, I should have kept doing my burpees, bro. Right. You know what I mean? And not smoking no fucking cigarettes. I don't drink. I don't do dope. I don't do none of that shit. You know what I mean? I smoke hella weed point break, though. Yeah. You know what I mean? Right. But that's 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 it. But, you know, I wasn't. And plus, you know, just you give water. stress. So you said something outside to me that that I thought that people should hear that was important. You said that oh, if, you, if, if, if you didn't do those burpees all them years, you'd probably be dead. Yes. Right? They're so, right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so that that's important to you, health and shit. Yeah, because I had a stroke, and then, like, four months before that, I got ran over by a car. Ooh. Holy shit. You so, think that's why you had the stroke? No, I, I got ran over by the car. I got better from that. My whole stomach's ripped open right here. You know what I mean? Mm. One of them things, probably. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I got, I got ran over by a car. Boom, I got better off that. I was supposed to die then, bro. Like, real talk. Even the fucking, you know, the cops were driving by. Ah, oh, they finally got you, Diesel. Ha, ha, ha. Type wow. shit. You know what I'm saying? Wow. And boom. Are you going to tell us who did it? Fuck no, I'm not going to tell you who did it. So, you know, now the paramedics were trying to give me fentanyl and all types of shit. So I was refusing to even take any drugs. I went through my whole surgery up. Oh, my God. Because they were trying to give me some motherfucking fentanyl. Well, how said it was painful just one was of that? Things. It was huh? a how painful was that? I was going through, but hey. If it wasn't for my burpees, I don't think I would have went through that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Right. Like, and then after that, four months later, boom, I'm good. I get back. I'm performing and everything. Like, you know what I mean? I'm good. Next thing you know, boom, I'm smoking hell. I ain't gonna lie. This music shit gets you stressed out a lot. Definitely. So I'm smoking now. I'm smoking a pack and a half a day of cigarettes. Boom. Next thing you know, I go to reach for a fucking, I was changing the mic thing. On, in the studio, and I just got hell and I'm like, right now, I'm still half no. Yeah. But, you know, I push, pull, strive, bro. Mm, right. You know what I mean? That, them were the words in my head the whole time. Right. You know what I mean? Right. Real talk. You and I, you. I, don't, I don't think people realize how important that is, right? To, to, to have, like, you know, uh, the philosophy of push, pull, strive. You know what I mean? To, to, to have that in your head, to have that every day. Like, like that's, that's how we live. You know what I mean? That's what, that, that's, that's I'll our, that's our morning, morning and live like that. Yeah. That's our, that's our mantra, you know right? Mean? Like, get up you know and make I mean? your bed and program, homie. <laughs> right. You know what I mean? And I yeah, think it's, it's, it's important <laughs> home, I'm doing because everybody that. talks about all the negatives, 
right? But but nobody talks about the positives, right? right. Because the negatives, the negatives are always going to be louder than the positives, right? And but to have that the, that program, to have that push pull strive, to have that you know move forward, you know what I mean? Always be you know be above everyone equal. Yeah. That all that all Lead shit by right example. there. Yeah, that right there is something that 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 needs to be more pushed upon. Uh, you know what I mean? Especially in Northern California, you ain't gotta be a homie. I'm just saying, just just in general, right? Reach yeah. for the stars. You ain't got to push, be lost. Push, stride. You know, we tell ourselves, you know, right? Like yeah. like like you. You could have just gave up. You could have rolled over and died when you got ran over. Hey, believe right? me. Hey. I got a good doctor though. I ain't gonna lie. He's, he's, he's a good doctor. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey. But um, if it wouldn't have been for that though, like real talk, like right. you know, and my granddaughter came in, threw my cigarettes in the toilet. Like you ain't smoking no more. So I was like, hey, like us, you how old became, are you? Became a mechanism. Remember we got my forties too. Yeah, we yeah. gotta take Damn. care of ourselves, bro. Right. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I, hey, and I was on that. Oh, they're giving me these blood, these diabetes medicine. Cause when I left the pen, I was diabetic. I found out. Yeah. But when I left, they were like, I was doing so much workout, but they were like. Here's your pills, but you don't even need them. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. But then I got home. I started eating every goddamn thing I yeah. seen. Yeah, I did too. And, uh, but not home, but I'm, yeah. You know what I mean? Well, you know? But when I quit music, I said, out, hey. Hey, that's one thing, though. But the only thing that's fucked me up now on the stroke thing is my performance. Oh, right. yeah. You did good, though. Yeah, he seen me perform right after the stroke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can't stop, bro. Like, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, but, but that push pull stride it's can't the, stop, won't yeah, stop it's though. The vibe, well, the motivation. It's a, it's a mindset, man. And a lot of people out here talk about, I'm depressed. I'm going through some shit. Of course, nah, see, you, that's you that. You just yeah. said it. You that's for that. sure going through yes. that. Because you, that, no, you bro, no, nah, bro. This is what it is, bro. At the end of the day, bro, Beat we're men. We're men, bro. We're men. We have structure in our lives. You know what I'm saying? All that. I'm depressed, and I got yeah, this. Yeah. Look at me. I ain't never done nothing in my life for a pat on my back. I just know I'm a man. And as soon as I chose to have kids, my life don't come first. You feel me? All that crying about this and crying about that, and I need Real. a little pat, and I needed applause. Real. Man, shut the fuck up, yeah. man. Sit the fuck down. Fuck you, Our man. man. We're <laughs> men. We're men. We protect and we provide. And no matter anything that hits us, anything that tries to knock us down, we are going to get it because we have the structure and the knowledge and education to keep going and how to do it. You right. feel me? All those mo- And let me hear a motherfucker right. talk about him having a bad day. Right, don't yeah. don't throw yourself your own, but it's yeah. your fight fall. Come on, man, shit. you better get your ass up, man. Pull that thing out, man. Yeah. Fuck, keep mobbing, man. We're men. Right, we're men. Right, yeah. and men. Then, and you getting ran over, and then what? Four months later, having a stroke. That could have been you. Could you could have gave up right then, but then you still came back. You still pushing the shit. Yeah, I'm here so, right now. Like, that's right. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Poor Stripe. He said, "I got up, I can keep a pushing." Yeah, right. yeah. We just you have know what I mean. I got get a stop. chance to meet you before I died. We you know, know what I mean? Uh, yeah. We all now. But you, but you're here for a reason, right? And now, now, now we're to get together. You know what I mean? We are hooked up. You know what I mean? And this ain't gonna I be. I think the last. music is my reason, and our and our homies, because that's the only thing I know how to do. Right. Hey, so I'm not gonna go build a house or fucking work in a car or be a plumber. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> Just real quick. I got you. He was he uh, this guy in Hayward. Yo, your your fellas was what? Were you this, one of them? Yeah, we're this Latin two hundred nine. We were the we were the first chapter that uh, started, and then Changalini was right like a couple days Jumping after. Down, yeah. Uh, Shout this Latin Chang- Sac Valley. Me. They were they were right after. Who shit. used to do y'all beats though? Black Rhino, really dope. Black Crazy Eight from Black Rhino, R.I.P. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that that dude. I still got some sleeper beats that no one's heard that are Ooh. tucked. But uh, I need to come back. Yeah. Him. Before he died, <laughs> before he died, right? Because he died of a heart attack, and um, I was in Vegas uh, like two weeks before he had a heart attack, and uh, he, like he was real like stingy with his beats. Like with me, he would be like, "Well, here's two beats." Here's three beats, right? Like, like just on the strength, no charge or nothing. And then I'd give him some money. He'd be like, well, here's five beats. But then before he died, right, um, I was getting ready to go back to Stockton. He was like, hey, bro, how many beats you want? I was like, shit, I'll take all of them. So yeah. give me your flash drive. He gave me his flash drive. He goes, as many beats could fit in there. They're yours. Wow. Man. I was like, what, for real? I was like, now you lying, bro. Uh, he was like, he was like. Do it. So I put it in there. I said, I'm grabbing all these beats, bro. Like, don't lie. I'm, I'm going to use them. He was like, man, shut You're the dead. fuck up. Just do it. So I drug over all the beats. Like I said, like, that's how he made his money, right? Well, he sold beats. He didn't have a job. He was all music and shit. 
So by me taking it, I probably took over a hundred thousand dollars worth of his beats, right? But he made them all day, like so it wasn't nothing to him. Mm-hmm. So when I grabbed him, I was like, I was still like skeptical. I was like, man, for real? He was like, bro, it's good. Skeptical. Skeptical. I never had rice. Oh man, my fucking. I never had rice. <laughs> my brain be fucked up, but yeah, I was skeptical. <laughs> How you say that shit? Skeptical, skeptical, skeptical. Oh, yeah, there you go. That was that was in Mexican. That's why. Yeah. So. Orale. <laughs> but anyways, so I yeah, so uh, I was I was like, man, what the fuck is going on, right? Like, uh, you know, didn't think nothing of it. So I get it, get home, calling him up. He's like, how you doing, man? Cool. I was like, how you doing? He goes, oh, suffering, bro. I was like, what you mean? He's like, suffering. It's like you good, dude. You can go to hospital. He goes, yeah, then we'll go to hospital, man. I'm not feeling too good, and. uh Fucking went to the hospital and uh, fucking ended up having a mild heart attack. They sent him home. Oh, and then uh, he went back to the hospital, had a major heart attack. They kept him in there for three weeks. His insurance uh, would only cover him for three weeks. And then, uh, fuck, dude, uh, I called him. He was like, yeah, fool, they're sending me home. I'm going home because I'm going to fucking die. And then, uh, like, yeah, they like, sent you really, home now. He said, he said, <laughs> he said, I'm gonna fucking die. I don't know why they're letting me out. So they let him out, dude, that night or the uh, the night after. I'm sorry, he uh, he had a, a stroke and he, he he passed away. So that was like hard for me, but yeah, he was the one that made my beats. And uh, yeah, I I cherish those things, you know what I mean? So he got a couple, yeah. you know what I mean? I'm shooting him some. But I'm real, I'm 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 real particular with him because that's all I have left of him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. And that was like my brother, bro. You know what I mean? Like he was. Uh, and at first, he probably didn't want to give him to you because some people, like my son and TC, they be going through this. They get people get beats off them, and they don't put them out. Right. Yeah. Like, what are you doing? You're just sitting at home practicing, or like, you know what I'm saying? Like. No, nah, but the 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 issue with that is, and people get it. Like, I got producers I mess with consistently, right? And they're like. Damn, you didn't. You don't got none of my beats on it on the album. You don't got. Yeah. This, you don't got that. And and I'm like, uh, you you I ain't, I'm not just putting out, especially with people that I'm close to, right? That I gotta see you every day. I'm not just gonna get drunk in the studio, do some yeah. shit, and put it out for the sake of just having content. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, it just it means more coming Ooh. from right, especially yeah. if you get them from 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 your boys and shit, right? Yeah. Like. Um, Shout out Droopy, J E the Will Man. Yeah. yeah. My my Jay. Bro, my bro Tom, Thomas Caldwell, man, he gave me a beat. He gave me yeah, he gave me a beat. And I think I showed it to you uh for you to get on it. You were like, Yeah, I want to get on it. And like I said, like I don't like putting out just anything or, right. or shooting anybody's beats. Like if something was given to me, man, I cherish that shit. Yeah. So I want it to come out dope. I don't want to just like you said, right. just fucking put put out no bullshit just because I'm writing one day and I'm bored. Like I want to put out, I want to put out the best project possible right. with that beat. Especially and, now, especially right. When, the more the more people expect from you, the the more higher standards you hold for yourself. Yeah. Especially you know when you're dealing with your homies, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you, with your son, the same way, right? Yeah, uh, yeah. And matter of fact, I got some beats for y'all for TCM, my son. Oh, <laughs> yeah. shit. Oh, wow, yeah. Calico beats in. I'm about to start rapping today, guys. <laughs> TC the enhancer, right? Yeah. TC. Well, he's not an enhancer. They have they used to be together. Oh, okay. And, and you know, TC was doing all the work, real talk, bro. Like, you know what I mean? But TC, yeah, that, yeah that's TC eleven five, Coop Nut. Right. Andre uh, Nicotino. Cool man. You what? know what I'm saying? Yeah, uh, rest peace, Coop Nut. Because TC, he's he, he he all them that that I've been with him for since Ghetto Confessions. Okay. I've been with him for like, it's like 25, 25 years. years. Oh, damn. He's the only one I went to prison. Yeah, slice some of those. But... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, slice some of those. Hey, TC mastered my first album, wow. uh, Money Clip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He mastered a lot of uh, Big Osolo's first album, too. He He's the Bay Area. Like, he's the Dr. Dre of the Bay. Right. Yeah. So. Okay. Straight up. He, when it, he, Wow, there's an argument though, huh? That's an argument, right? Like, shout out TC, but man, uh, duh, man, there's EA Ski. Oh yeah. There's so many like. Yeah, there's EA. There's a lot Rick of Rick Rock. Rick Rock. Well, I asked all them. Yeah. What no, you I think about TC? Damn, yeah. yeah, I believe you. TC yeah. is the legend. You know what I mean? Yeah. The real talk, and, and he don't do beats for a lot of people. Just, I've been with him. I stay solid. I stay loyal. Was TC? Yeah. Wasn't he in that group with Ten Dollar? 
Yeah, totally insane. He put yeah, out totally, totally insane. insane. Oh, yeah. Matter of fact, we, yeah. 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 Matter of fact, oh, I love insane. that. Yeah, you got totally insane. We're at. I want to put him, us on a song with at. Oh hell yeah, oh, GC yeah, Park yeah, that'd be dope. I'll do the yeah. intro. You can't handle it. <laughs> I'll do the intro. I'll list. Yeah. No problem on the Good intro, problem, bro. Man. You feel me? Let's yeah. get it. So that's that, my shit. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, man, totally insane was fucking dope. Ten dollars was hard see, as I, shit. Wasn't it kind of hard to listen Mad, to music back Mad then, though? Because you guys had to do like cut my yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Shut up, bro. <laughs> Your first family picture was in a cave. Ad's still doing music. He just came out with some shit. Some oh yeah, shit, yeah. Oh, okay. A lot of OGs are coming back right now. Black right. Sea, you know he, he does. Yeah, he makes it. Too, he's yeah. Even functions for yeah. Real. I got a lot of songs with Black Sea. My nephew too. Like you know what I mean? He's good people. Yeah. What's up, Black? You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, we gotta get black on here too. Yeah, for sure, bro. Yeah. That's Bay Area. Like, yeah, love so. to get TC yeah, on Frisco here games too. Yeah, yeah. Uh, hell of the uh, Niners games. Yeah. 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 I seen him at, uh, I seen him all the time actually. See him all the yeah. He be outside doing his thing. He be outside. He be yeah, so thing. you got a lot of history. Right, you 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 fuck with a lot of history. Yeah, you know what I mean a lot of a lot of Bay Area history. Yeah, and like, wow, yeah. you know, it's it's exciting to hear about that because those were like our legends growing up, right? So that's when we yeah. we in high school we doing dirt uh, to all these fools. You know, real talk, school, prison fucked us up school. a little bit because back right. then we had all the features on the album. We had Totally Insane, Mac Dre, when Mac Dre was alive and all that shit. But you know, the pen fucked us up. You know what I'm saying? We lived that life, so we we went. To to prison, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know, you know what's crazy is you don't really consider until we started doing this, uh, uh, doing this interview, started looking up information on us, how, 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 uh, uh, consistent Hayward has pushed out, uh, not just homie music, but music, uh, Bay Area yeah, music, in yeah, general. Hayward, yeah. really, man, as far as homie music, yeah. got Ali Bo, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Ali Bo, Ali Bo too. yeah, uh, Ali Bo, my, little my brother, Joe little Joe, yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? I was in the county with uh, Chip, Chipper. Yeah, Chipper. Chipper. Oh, yeah. I just did a song with Chipper. Yeah, that's my you boy right there. Man. Hey, we Chipper, one double yeah. one for yeah. sale. Yeah, yeah. Shout, shout out, shout yeah. out my boy Chipper, man. Yeah. Hey. Ten dollars, man. He that's just got home. Like right he there. a brother too. He's yeah. a homie though. Yeah. You know what I mean? Okay. That's uh, like my neighborhood is Irish. barely any Mexicans, yeah. bro. Yeah. That's we good. we, we yeah, got Guamanians. We got Puerto Ricans. We got Mexicans. Guamanians, huh? Guamanians, yeah. My Guamanians in my hood are bloods. Yeah. But they bang the D. Yeah. Like, Shout you know, out, my boy. I love them. That's my bloodline. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. Hey. Yeah, Chip came home after a minute. We was in uh, the <laughs> county together, the man, when uh, we was both fighting our cases and shit back yeah. in shit, 2012. Yeah. Chip a good yeah, I mean, dude. Chip, yeah, real good dude, man. He put me on a lot of game. A lot of game, man. You know what I'm saying? So who would you say would be the most influential person you worked with? Besides me. Tretch from Naughty by Nature. Oh, oh shit! So you did a song with Tretch? Yeah, it's on that album right there. Oh hey. shit! On on Thiz yeah. Latin Hey with the best of yeah, it rains game. Oh, get with it or get hit with it. Oh shit! I gotta oh, listen to that. Yeah, I'm gonna listen Tretch to it. Tretch is dope. Tretch is dope. TC. TC. Tretch, Tretch fucked with TC too. But you fucked with a lot of man. I'm Mac Dre. Yeah, uh, Mac Dre. I did listen. He says my name on the song. Diesel. Yeah. 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 It ain't like I just got a verse from Mac Dre or that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Like you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like. He was good people, bro. Like, if I wouldn't have went to the pen, I would probably have been fucking with Dre. You know bro, I mean? yeah. I, and back then, people didn't want to open the doors for you like that. Damn oh, yeah. yeah, for real. yeah. It, like, He's gatekeeping everything. But the CDs was cracking way harder than this shit is. Oh, yeah, definitely. Matter of fact, I, yeah. I did my whole five-year prison term. My lady, my wife, Patty Lunch, she was dropping off CDs to them, to Rasputin's and all that shit. Dimples. And I, dimples uh, out here. Um, yeah. Yeah. Fucking Justin out here from what is yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's a CD? Um, <laughs> <laughs> but hey, I I did my whole money in my books the whole time, bro. Yeah. All my ghetto confession neighborhood family shit. Yeah. yeah. Now I listen to that shit. I don't even like that shit. I'm gonna keep it real. That old shit. <laughs> I mean, I yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. I'm the same way with my old shit. Yeah. I'm yeah, the same way too. It's so cringy. Yeah. Like, damn. But but that Why just goes that? to show how you I evolve, that, uh, right? <laughs> we all evolve. Right? You gotta start somewhere. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like like you can hear you can hear the difference of my old shit to, yeah. to my new shit. But I mean that's how you that's how you get you know you get better, dude. And every yeah. album, you know what I mean? If, if I like you're not your evolved, old shit, bro. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. <laughs> but uh, every album gets better though. 
You know what I'm saying? Like every song you do, it bro. Gets- I might be biased, but I'm gonna tell. I'm he ain't even in here right now. But I'm gonna tell you. Uh, you know whose music like stands the test of time, and I be listening. Nobody has never even heard it because he only dropped it through SoundCloud when SoundCloud was first things. J King, dude. What? Oh yeah, uh-huh. he got some dope it's, shit. Oh, it's like yeah. It's if we really if we were dope. to drop that shit, yeah. that shit is dope. Like I like J King's old yeah. shit. Yeah, if, I want to hear that shit. Yeah, if, I, I want to hear it too. Like, if, if, Jeez, if Jeezy was a white blood <laughs> and, had, and had Bay Area slang, yeah, that was, <laughs> that's yeah. that motherfucker. He's yeah, dope. Bro. Cool. No, he is dope. Yeah. I'm yeah. about to download Spotify right now. No, it's, it's a uh, SoundCloud. SoundCloud. What's that? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that young. Now nah, people act like he's still in diapers. Bro, you know the worst part is I went to the union hall, right? And my boy was like, you know, you're in the carpenters union, so you could do like the the, the pile drivers yeah. union, mill rights, and then a drywall, and then mine, you know, I do scaffolding. Yeah. And then I was like, yeah, I'll just tell him I'm young and I can, you know what I mean? And he was like, hold on, bro. Young is like a 21 year old kid now, but like, you're not young. <laughs> and I was like, fuck, man. Shut yeah. boy, easy, man. You know what I mean? I was yeah. Like, um, I feel so young because everybody I hang out with is at least 10 years older than me. Yeah. <laughs> it gives me that you little... Know what? We, when we were kids, when I was a kid, I was already old at 13. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah. I was cooking cream in, in, in the trap at 13. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, for real. I was like, just selling you know, weed, but they, man. Now you see these kids... Really, they're spoiled because their yeah. fathers don't want them to go through the bullshit that we went through. Yeah, yeah that's why I leave my kids. I let them grow up on their own. Like, I holla at really? them. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'm hey, that, that's that's the real shit, right? Because yeah. like I, I was like, man, my daughter didn't have to go through not yeah. even not even a percentage of the shit. I they, she she don't know shit. She ain't seen shit to what I seen. They got yeah. thirteen, yeah, they fourteen, got, fifteen. We were, man, we were in the trenches for real. You yeah. know what I mean? Like, and, and we were fighting grown men, shooting at grown men. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, Allegedly. like you know, I, I mean, it is what it is. I'm going to yeah. say it, right? It, it, it happened. Like, this is, what, this is what we really did. You know what I mean? I learned how to drive by stealing a car. You know right. what I mean? And driving right. in, driving in the green belt, it's, Blue Ridge Circle. They don't know nothing about they it. They don't even know what a Dolphin <laughs> Rental is. Right. They don't even know what a Dolphin <laughs> Rental is. Yeah. They have no idea about they the They heard it in the Bobby started. song. Yeah. <laughs> they have no idea about pulling back the eight ball. Yeah. What's the eight ball? Like, bro, on, if man. you know, you know. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But, I mean, that's, that's it's what like we that. went through. But My we opinion want is, if you ain't sold no crack, you ain't got no game. No, that ain't true. <laughs> These dudes got a different kind of game, right? The game evolves, Girl right? Scammer. That is the game, right? The game is evolving with the times, right? So you can't really. That's why, man. But I'm talking about like in back right, in like day. cream. Mm-hmm. If it was bad or good, you was gonna hustle it off, right? Now new drugs. Well, it just got to be good. No, no, I don't. No, I don't. They. Oh, we ain't gonna talk about this on here. <laughs> <laughs> but, but yeah, yeah, no, it don't. But the game evolves. Go, yeah, yeah, the game evolves in a and uh, I'm I'm gonna tell you something. I guess it's like the music. Though. It is like the music, bro. Right? If you don't stay current, if you if you not because because we actually dealing with youngsters out here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And and it's like uh uh it's like that that finding that medium. Like you don't want them to have to go through it, but you want them to have enough game to where they don't they don't get they're not they're not victims to it. You Matter of fact, I'm, I'm doing an album on that whole situation, young and old. Mm-hmm. I, it's a, it's gonna be a um, I'm working on that too right now. I, I got like 60 songs that are like not done, but um, one side is gonna be a double disc, right? And one two seven songs. One side is gonna be respect your elders, mm-hmm. you know, and the other side is gonna be respect the youngster. Yeah. And I'm gonna let my little youngsters do their thing, and I'm gonna do my thing with the OG yeah. thing. Mm-hmm. But it's gonna be on the same CD, nothing but love. An actual you, CD. I'm gonna do actual CD oh, okay. and a, and a, and yeah. a line. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know what I mean? Dope. Then that, that, that way, cause you know the OGs gonna be like these youngsters, boom, boom, boom. Yeah. A friendly competition, bro. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? yeah. The homies in the pen always ask me for CDs, but yeah, yeah. I, I, like, I know where to get. I know where you could get them. Yeah. Okay. yeah. You can't though. That's not how that works. Not no more. Walking yeah. the worst. Not, That's the order of so this is what we've been dealing with, right? This is the problem that I I low key had with 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 uh, toes, right? Well, it was I'm like quick. Yeah, yeah, it was like the um the the access to a walking horse. And, oh yeah, and trying to figure that out. And one year goes by, two years go by, and I I did twenty three years in prison. All my brothers want to hear my stuff. They hit me all the time, like, man, what's up? When you gonna get this stuff in the catalogs and i'm like man i I don't know how to get in the catalog now we know how to get in the catalog right right but but um it 
I had to figure it out myself. You know what I'm saying? I had to figure yeah. it out myself. And that's, but going back to that, like that's something that, you know, is dope, right? Because you're, you're showing, you're showcasing the old and the new, mm-hmm. right? That right there is fucking dope to me. And it's like giving, it's giving the young homies, like, because we didn't have nobody to look out for us back when nah. we were there. Right? I think my Calico Kids meets these CDs in there right now. Calico oh, yeah. stuff is in there for really? sure. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah. we we didn't have nobody to show us the game. We had to learn all it the ourselves. dude, all this Latin stuff is in there. I remember it's on it's in the actual catalog, like pictures of it. Cause some CDs will be like just had a name of it, boom, yeah. boom, 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 and it'll have the square right, right. right where you can see like what the CD cover looked like. Right. You know what I mean, Th- the this Latin stuff was always in there. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's dope. Was my shit in there? I'm yeah. sure. <laughs> you I don't know. Up? Somebody's yeah. making money off yes. you. You don't know about. Yes, your stuff was in there. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, mental illness. Was right. In there. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's shit. That's dope. You know what I mean? But yeah, the 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 I sold more CDs on the street than anywhere else. So you know what I mean? We really? made a we made a dope ass living off that. You yeah, know what yeah. I mean? And like. Shit, you you need gas money. You need even back then, right? Yeah. We were we were hustling Juke broke. CDs but we need shit. we need yeah. gas money. Yeah, we just jug CDs and we, yeah. we off, man. We hungry. I right, let's sell these CDs real quick. Yeah, we yeah, had that hustle though. Yeah. You know what yeah. I mean? Like me, I look. I still got flyers and posters. I still right. literally yeah. get out there, go to the Berkeley College the and shit. fucking put up hella posters, bro. Yeah. You know what I mean? I look at it like I'm working out though. <laughs> you know what I mean? But that's still that's still part of promotion, right? Because right, anywhere right. somebody Even can now, see your yeah. shit. Yeah. And old school's the best school, and you could meet your fans. Right. When you hand them a flyer, it's different than hey, look that up. When you move, 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 you ever check. Right. You could old actually... school sniping and shit, right? Because it puts people like What's sni- sniping. Sniping means putting posters up in okay. the middle of the night without nobody knowing on all the street poles like and wherever else. Shit. And the ops yeah. hood, like right. Sh- and, <laughs> and so it's it's, <laughs> it's, guns, it's a marketing ploy because just like uh, like you see a McDonald's, <laughs> you see a McDonald's on every corner, right? Yeah. You recognize the logo, like you see album covers on every corner. Yeah. You're gonna recognize that. So when it's time to go, when you're looking for some new music, like ah. Oh, I seen this CD. I seen this fucking cover up on fucking every telephone pole in my city. See what it's about, right? Because you get curious. Yeah. You're out of sight, you're out of mind. Right. You ain't in their face all the time. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So <laughs> that's that's the, uh, still a good form of promotion yeah. that I think people lost because everybody depends on the internet, right? Even when people do shows, all they do is internet promotion. Then they wonder why their shows ain't right, popping. Because the internet right? bigger than your hood. It's not you're you're, in, you're doing the paper ones. It's right. in your hood. They're just right. they're just elements. I ain't gonna lie. My uh, kids do my inter- internet. Hey, yeah. they do my Instagram. I'm still old school, like struggling yeah. how to learn this shit. Oh okay, yeah, you're tripping. We all all <laughs> do music. You gotta learn all that. I, stuff. I'm learning. Just, yeah, it's really, all believe me. Oh, I got a team that's on everything. I yeah, there you, like, go. you know what I mean? Like, they're they're showing me things. I'd be like, damn. You know what I mean? I didn't know that. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, tight. No, and that and 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 that's dope, dude. You have the history, you, you know what I mean. You got the game, and you still pushing, man. And uh, shout out to you for yeah. overcoming all your obstacles and and everything you went through, and still being here and still pushing, man. Like I said, hey, shout you, out bro. to y'all for keeping this. You're North one of the flame pieces flame of yeah. the puzzle, right of the lane, of what it is. Yeah, yeah. I want to hear your music, that. bro. Ma? Oh, shit. oh yeah, we were just talking. About <laughs> we were just talking about it right yeah. now. Yeah, I, yeah. we were talking about. Um, we were talking about how some people, like me personally, like when I hear my old stuff, I'm like, oh, yeah, like some of it is, whether it's the it's what I'm saying or it's the mix or it's right. you know what I'm saying. But the only thing that doesn't really get old is listening to your stuff. Right. Or I'll be like, yeah, that's yeah. we gotta put that shit out. <laughs> Everybody hit the comments if you want to hear J. Yeah, hit me. Let me know if you want to. We'll, we'll drop J. Key we shit tomorrow. Two others they recorded it so long. Yeah, and it's all his music, so it won't be interrupting. Real, real. <laughs> <laughs> I wrote my hey, come to my studio, man. You can record, man. I can do it. You got the you got the whole studio right here. He don't record. Oh, like, that. <laughs> <laughs> I got kids and shit. Put your kids right now. Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, man. Is there anything else you want to say, man? We'll yeah. wrap this up, man. This. Shout out to the whole Northern California, man. Work. Hey, don't condone the bullshit. And hey, what up to everybody, man? No yes, man. fly zone on fuckery. Yeah, yeah Calico man. ENT. What's up to King Tiger OG? You know, of course, South Hayward, Hayward. You know what I mean? Even the West, too. You know what I mean? Like the whole Hayward, man. You know what it, you know what it is. And 
appreciate no paperwork podcast, man. Yeah, yeah sir. And, and keep pushing for that unity, man. Yeah, yeah I know I, you, I, you. I'm with that. Or, you were talking about that. I'm, in I'm, with, I'm with our unity. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah, yeah unity. Whatever we could do to uh, push that forward, too, we would. Hey, man, I appreciate yeah. it, man. So uh, and 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 this is the first time we we getting together, but it ain't gonna be the last, right? You know what I mean? We're gonna no, see this you is again. Just the beginning, you know, it, it's <laughs> it's building blocks, and, and you know, part of the podcast is is to build, build with each other. You know what I mean? No matter who we have on here, you know, doesn't matter the race, the, the hood, whatever. Anybody we get on here, man, we trying to build with each other. You know what I mean? Right. And we are gonna push you. You know what I mean? And hopefully you push us. But we ain't we ain't asking for that in return. But we are gonna do right. it. You know what I mean? Right. And if the love is reciprocated, man, Absolutely. that's even better. You know. What Oh yeah. oh yeah, look for uh King Tiger OG um sliding with the team. It comes out on September 16th. Sliding with the oh, team. So, oh, so, yeah, we're gonna be slapping it for sure. Oh, yeah. soon, then. Definitely. Yeah. Appreciate yeah. all y'all for Mexican Captain Independence man. Day for yeah, sure. That's right. For sure. Yeah. Hey yeah. man. All right, shout out to you. Shout out to Thiz Latin Thank Hayward. Shout you. out to Calico you. Entertainment. Everything Not Calico. For everybody. Uh, we appreciate you coming by, man. My guy. For myself, yeah. Joe Bob, J King. Fats, you know what I mean? Dope BFD. Hey, uh, Dopest podcast cook. Hey, we appreciate you, man. Hey, no paperwork podcast, man. Conversation. One love. Conversation, baby. Peace out. Special turf journalists. You know it.